Yo, what's up, guys? I wasn't, uh... I wasn't gonna stream today. Um... But why not? I got something new. I got Sniper Ghost Warrior Contracts 2. I, you know... I'm down with the Sniper games. I'm cool with that, so... Uh... I figured you'd be a good one to play. So... Uh, forgive me, I'm trying to, uh... Sign into my other phone here real quick. And uh we'll get going. Got the green screen going today, so I feel good about that. Da da dum. Da 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 da. So how's y'all's days been so far? My day has been just fine. I uh went snowboarding yesterday. Had the day off, decided not to stream. Uh, went snowboarding, and um, today I found an old set of snowboarding bindings um, that not only look really good, but they feel really good too. They're uh, ride bindings. Um, they're mostly like aluminum too. So, all right, let's see here. So, but yeah, hi, Chuck Charleston here. Um, yeah, for some reason, my, my phone won't connect to the friendly Wi-Fi that I have in my house now. Uh, all right, here we go. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, so I got a bunch of DLCs. I got a bunch of add-on stuff. This is the first time... I'm opening it up on my PlayStation. Okay. 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 Barely visible. Yeah, that looks pretty good right there. Okay. I take it it is auto saving right now. <laughs> All right. Game. Greetings, Raven. Thank you for accepting this commission, and welcome to Kuamar. For the past 20 years, it has been controlled by two people, President Omar al-Bakr and his wife, Bibi Rashida. Their regime is both cruel and brutal, but we saw no reason to interfere. Till now. We have actionable intel Kuamar is planning an offensive against a neighboring state. A war here is unacceptable. It will disrupt the whole region, inflating global oil prices. The conflict was triggered by the assassination of President al-Bakr. His wife has taken power, but her grip is weak. Some within her government resent both her gender and Western education. However, she's supported by a close network of warlords. They provide troops and weaponry to warlords. Russia, reinforcing her control and preventing open revolt. The regime is financed by the hacker and crypto anarchist Lars Hellstrom. Wanted Lars by Hellstrom. multiple agencies, he threatens governments, rigs elections, and holds corporations to ransom. Together, they are the masterminds behind this offensive. We need you to shut them all down. We also have a friendly in country, Taj Tahir, a journalist and the son of one of Russia's few political opponents. He disappeared after being arrested on espionage charges. Find him. Kumar's terrain is both arid and mountainous, so getting close to a target may not be possible. We know you're a long shot specialist, so this shouldn't be a problem. Your new gear should help, especially the prototype visor. It has an enhanced battlefield display and a direct comms link to me. Rashida and her allies cool. cannot be allowed to ignite the region. Her war must be stopped. I'll be in touch. I'll be in touch. Okay. So I I'm going to admit I haven't played the first one. Um and so the visor thing looks new. Um I wonder if it's uh I wonder if it's anything like um Hitman or um what's the other one? Sniper Elite that I play where you can tag enemies and where you have like 
binoculars and like all that kind of stuff, maybe. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Okay, so you can upgrade your mask. Support and stealth. That's, that's cool as shit. Cost, and of course I don't have anything. <laughs> drone so can I use my drone on stuff well that's neat journal okay okay so these are all my tutorials then I guess so my, let's see I know I'm gonna have to do this hang on let me uh Oops. Let's see. For, yep. 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 I'm, I'm different. I require backward stuff. I grew up playing PlayStation with mostly like airplane games. So that's what I got used to playing with. So now anytime that I ever have to play, I'm always... Um, Inverting my stuff. Okay, let's see. Let's go. Uh, oops. Dang it. Start contract. All right. Contract details. Okay. Okay, so this is like the tutorial type. Play without punishment, fun and engaging, sniping mechanics of weight, compelling enemies and enjoyable challenges. Play your own way. Red Dot Aim Helper is available. Should we go sharpshooter release? Special skills and test engage with accessible sniping mechanics. Balance enemies, interesting challenges. Red Dot Aim Helper is unavailable by default. Can be switched on in settings. Um what is this? Ready for challenging sniper mechanics, dangerous enemies, and demanding challenges. Only veterans can apply. I'm gonna go with. This is the realistic sniping mechanics. I don't think I'm ready for that yet. I'll go sharpshooter. Sounds like a challenge. How's the heat there, Raven? It's time to get familiar with your weapons and gear. The tactical visor we supplied provides a live feed from your scope. It's equipped with an advanced combat display. You'll be able to scan terrain as well as tag and track hostiles. We've also given you some extra tools. We'd prefer it if you didn't break them. We'd prefer, prefer if you didn't break them. On our live fire range. Once you're happy, we can move on to the mission itself. It's funny that so many... Uh game developers are starting to implement drones a lot more. I mean, why not? It's it's the future, right? Shit. If I had a little pocket drone that I could use to... Shit. Man, I'd be causing so much havoc. Guaranteed. Training rifle ahead by the OP. Pick it up and let's begin. Roger that control. Pick up rifle. It's the same. Let's see. Crouch up. Walking. Okay. So it's the same type of mechanics as like Call of Duty. Uh, I feel like that needs to be quicker. make it 70 see what happens there uh. 
Oops. Let's make it 65. Oops. Yeah, that's better. One more time. All right, let's see, pick up. Okay, press and hold. Take a prone position to stabilize your switch on your binocular display to enable hostile tags. Press left for just binocular. Tag the target straight ahead, you 12 o'clock. Tagging hostiles will give you their range and keep track of their movements. Your scope also allows you to measure range to targets. Go to glass and see for yourself. The upper left quadrant in your scope is a rangefinder. The target's height on that scale indicates their distance from you. It'll change according to your zoom ratio. Focus on your... Measuring distance. Find a target's distance by tapping through binoculars or using tagging bullet. But sometimes it's easier to do this with your rifle scope. All scopes have a fixed scale in meters. Okay. Try to position a standing enemy in a way, okay, that his height fits exactly between the scale's lines. You can read the enemy's distance there. Interesting. Okay, that's cool. Breathe. Splash I like that. Target. Aim for the head. Let's see, L3 to stabilize. And squeeze. Hit. Go for the next one. Next target, your 12, 300 meters. I know you're used to doing the maths for range, wind speed, and direction in your head, but we've saved you some time. Good. Raven, find your next target. Adjusting your Ooh. scope to target's range will improve accuracy. I've marked okay. the distance for you. Set your scope elevation to 400. By calibrating your scope properly, you won't have to manually adjust your aim up or down to compensate for the distance and bullet drop. Wow. Okay. Here we go. Squeeze. That's a miss. Oh. Double check your scope. Okay. The elevation setting needs to match the marked range to target. Okay. Well, it's at 400, so. Nope, that's not it either. It's the it's the yellow dot. I know it. Nope, I'm keep shoot keep shooting over him. Why do I keep shooting over him? What the heck? Okay. Interesting. Is it like bugging out on me or something? Good. Splash Weird. Now. That, what of ammo. what the fuck was that about? Needed. I know you're a marksman, but use your binoculars to tag hostiles before taking the shot. It'll give you distance to target to zero your scope. I gotta get used to doing smoother transitions with my looking around. This game is really fucking cool so far. Maybe I should turn my sensitive sensitivity down a little bit more. I mean, and I 
it could be the same for the drones. I have absolutely no, no idea. I'll go ahead and tag this guy while I'm at it. It's probably going to be jerky when you get out that far anyway. Let's just put it back on 50 and see if I get used to it. Sorry, guys. It's probably no big deal either, but whatever. Do I got any... What other targets do I got? Wow. Whew, he's way out there. Nine hundred meters out. All right. Well, I guess I'll start from left to right. I'll save the moving targets for last. Excellent. First target down. Ooh, he is way out there. Oh, did I miss him? Oh, I got him. No shit. This is wild. 500 meters. Taking me back to my military days. Not bad. Um, One more to go. Speaking of my military days, um... Let's see, what is it? Uh, February 16th um, starts the 30-hour gaming challenge. Um, you can go over to uh, stopsoldiersuicide.org and learn more or sign up. Um, you can also find them on Facebook, 30-hour gaming challenge. You can sign up there, log your hours online, stuff like that. So I'll be participating with that on top of my, uh, my regular streams. And uh, so, yeah, there you go. All right, so let's go ahead and mark this dude. Your scope is zero now. We can move on to the next stage of familiarization. Um, Enter the door behind you. Move I want to hit this dude at night. We have some additional meters. kit to familiarize yourself with. <laughs> Negative. I didn't realize I got one more to zoom. Oh, this only thing only goes out to a thousand meters. Got him. Get the hell out of here. Almost got that. He's moving though. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay, cool. I can change between. I want to hit this last standing target. What's he at? 700 meters? Drop is hard. Oh, 
Ah, uh, just missed him. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Reload. Got him. All right. How do you switch weapons? Is that how you, oh cool, you can throw rocks and stuff. What's over here? What's down? Down is that way. Wonder what the quick way of doing that is. That. All right. It's my Falcon drone. First up, Falcon drone. Pick it up. Select it from your inventory. Inventory. Now launching. Press R1 to launch the drone. The Falcon can see when you can't. There are two enemies behind that metal wall ahead. Locate and tag them with the drone. Let's see. Oh. It has a limited battery life, but will recharge when holstered. Call it back. The drone can hack CCTV boxes. We're looking into possible upgrades later. There's That's a CCTV cool. CCTV access point in the building below. Send the drone in and hack it. Oh shit. Okay. Yes, sir. See, anti drone tower. The military deploys heavy armor anti drone tower, so it would completely shut down your drone. You cannot destroy or disable these devices, just avoid their disruption field. Okay. Anti drone areas. Your Muav Falcon drone can detect when you are in range of an anti drone tower. The drone icon on your HUD and weapon wheel will change to red, and you will. Okay, you'll get a notification. Okay. So that means we can't use it at all? It's fucking whack. Don't try to destroy them. Just keep the drone out of their jamming range. Your mask's hood will indicate when you're close to one. Thankfully, their heavy armor does limit signal range. Use the drone to find an alternate route to the CCTV box. Can I get in through the window? That'd be cool. Oh man. Oh, I used up too much battery. Okay. I guess I gotta let it recharge again. Oops. Press down. Alright, let's try this again. Very handy. You're up to speed on the drone now. There's another piece of kit on the table. Have a look. P 
some kid on the table. What do we got? Turret. These auto turrets sync with your hood. You still need to mark hostiles for the turret manually, but it can then fire at your command. Remote turret. That's fucking awesome. Once placed, you set it up via your mask's binocular mode. Activate that now. Focus on the hostiles you tagged with the drone. Then you need to mark them for your turret. Remember, turret marking is separate from your binocular tagging. Oh wait, Once marked, I got it. <laughs> you can execute the fire command anytime. There we go. Okay, L3 to tag. Exit binocular mode. Command the turret to fire. You're done with gear familiarization. One thing I should mention, you can use a turret's inbuilt camera for overwatch, or use it to execute simultaneous shots if needs be. Also, the turrets are under constant development. We may be able to upgrade them later. That's all the new gear covered. We have a spot set up to test special That's ammo cool too. as shit. Or you can head straight out. There's a truck waiting in the back. Let's see how. What is that? Okay, I guess that's the. So I could probably see through shit. Okay. So how do I. How do I access the turret cam? Oops. Let's see, did it show that? Alright, whatever. I guess I'll deal with that later. Special bullets. Scope, uh, tweet special bullets. Okay. Where are my boys at down there? There we go. Crush triangle. Oh. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. BRB, guys. Sorry about that. Okay, cool. So, let's see. What is this? AP explosive bullet? What's explosive down here that I can fire at? Oh, is that what that was? Oh, sick. Armor piercing. Oh, that's cool as hell. Oh, I need to mark them first, I guess. I bet you you, prob you probably get uh, extra points for killing marked targets, too. Kind of like um, uh, Sniper Elite. 
JD. Sick. Right in the nuts. Dang, so this can pierce through fucking anything then, basically. Alright, what else we got? Heavy sniper rifle bullets. Where do you fire those? Okay. Alright, what is this? What do we got? Medium sniper, agile bullet. Use agile bullets to shoot without compensating for gravity and wind. What? Dang, man. Whoa, that is wild. An EMP bullet. That's cool. So I guess I can kill boxes like that too. Sick. All right, what else we got here? Medium sniper. All right, what we got? Light sniper rifle, we got a burying bullet. Oh. Oh, okay, I see. That's what that is. All right, tag and bullet. Okay, weird, I guess. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, you can't tag them. Is it because you can't see them, maybe? But that's okay. That's why you can't tag it. That's what a tagging bullet is. You fucking idiot. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Um. Oh, okay. So you can basically. Okay, I see. I see. Okay. Well, well, that's just cool as hell. I want this one though. Can you, <laughs> are they gonna give it to me? Oh yeah, what else can I do here? <clears throat> do I do anything else here? I guess not. All right, I'm out of here. Let's go shoot some fools. In your next mission, you'll be shooting at very long distances. You need to customize your rifle with an appropriate scope and loadout. Let's do it. 
Heavy sniper rifles like the UK-50 are loud, but can deliver a powerful bullet at any distance, which makes them a good fit for long shots. Enter the customization screen by using square. Okay. Optics. Okay. For long-range shooting, you need a scope to allow for greater zoom and suitable distance calibration. Okay. Extreme long-range. Okay, so I guess that's what we need. Okay. Currently, you're carrying a heavy sniper rifle. Extreme long-range scope you should be a good fit for your next task. You can customize your scope rifle for your task ahead. Okay. Development. Oh, okay. This is where we can upgrade stuff. Max and re mask and recon. How many tokens do I have? One. What does this do? Augmented eyesight. Hold L1 to activate thermal vision eyesight. Use it to discover enemies and devices emitting heat. Well, that's cool as shit. Can you kind of see my tokens. Tokens directly behind me. <laughs> Let's do it. Yep. You can buy both skills, but only one will activate at a time. Let me write this down. Da, 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 da. Let's see. Zinda province. Cool. All right. Fifteen thousand bucks and one token. Antoine Zara. Okay, so he's an arms dealer. Huh, okay. So these are one, two, three. So three targets and a sabotage, it looks like. Three targets and a sabotage. Disgrace SAS officer, Captain Ronald Payne. Russian GRU agent. Sabotage satellite antennas. Okay. Let's see. Kill the dealer. Okay. With an explosion. Ah, uh, okay. So these are all like assassination type challenges. So I guess similar to what uh, what you would see in Hitman. Um, that's neat. I mean, it's, eh, it's neat. Collectibles, okay. Gotcha. All right, let's, um. Let's go. Sharpshooter. That seemed, seemed like it was pretty fun. I'm sure you know. The record for the longest sniper kill belongs to a Canadian Special Forces operator. During the Iraq War, he hit a target over two miles away. Today's mission won't need you to hit anything that far, but it's still going to be a challenge. This operation is designated Cold Bore Zero. We're dropping you onto a plateau located within range of all three targets. Your window of opportunity is small, so hit and move. The first target here is Antoine Zaza, Rashda's favorite warlord and quartermaster. The Zaza clan are arms dealers alongside other criminal enterprises. Eliminate him and the Kuamari government will struggle to equip their militias. Your second target is a disgraced SAS officer, Captain Ronald Payne. He's in charge of the Army's tactical training and currently stationed at one of their boot camps. 
The third target is Colonel Fyodor Novikov, a Russian GRU agent sent here to control logistics and supply. Removing these actors from the board will seriously hamper Rashida's plans. Stay sharp. I'll be in contact when you arrive on site. Nice. Stick and move, he says. Stick and move. I'll take it. Okay, I'm gonna use this opportunity as a uh, to go uh, use the restroom. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Thank you for your patience. Control, do you read? This is Raven. Roger, Raven. What's your status? I've exited the Hilo. <laughs> I'm commencing recon of the plateau. Status. Intel indicates light foot patrols and some forward observation posts only. Proceed with caution, and you should reach the sniper hides with little opposition. Understood. The plateau will provide you with three OPs which overlook each target location. They should give you a good line of sight on any hostiles. Sounds like a piece of cake. Except for the range, and with no... I'm confident Sorry about you won't that, miss. guys. It's one of the reasons we picked you. No pressure, then. Let me know when you've reached the first Figured opening. I'd move my uh, camera out. over a little bit, maybe, so you can kind of see a little better. I don't know if that's... Let's see, can I move it down here? Let's do... Um... Move Rainmaker up. There we go. Hey, that works. All right. Cool. Now you kind of see what's going on a little better. All right. So what are we doing now? I missed that whole thing. Do I have a map? Yes, I do. Okay, cool. Can I move around this map? Yes, I can. Sweet. Okay, so... Oh, 
Oh, okay. So that changes. All right. What is this? Okay. So he's there. What is that? Okay. So they're down there. And there. And then that. Okay. Interesting. Where are the... Okay. There's the satellites. Okay. Custom waypoint. area contract area you can check your region map at any time this allows you to track progress contracts challenges collectibles red frames on your mark map on your map mark different contracts areas okay custom markers okay okay Oh, okay, so it'd be visible in mask mode too. Nice. That's mask mode. What if I press and hold R1? Okay, so I only got... I only got so much battery on that bad boy. That sucks. Lots of recon. Okay. So they got that guy looking out. Interesting. I wonder. I wonder if I take him out, if there's going to be anybody else watching. I like how the graphics in this are done. Interesting. Okay. for him to come back. Oh, no, no. Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, that was fucking sick. Dude. Okay, that's a fucking highlight. Oh my god. That's a fucking highlight. That was probably not a good idea. Holy shit, man. That was crazy. That was fucking crazy. His whole head fucking exploded. Yo. Alright. There's more dudes over here, obviously. Oh, is he gone now that I killed him? Like, gone from the game? That's wild. That's crazy. Oh, shit. There's another one in there. Okay, can I 
tag him? Yes, I can tag him now. Another one running over here somewhere. Two? That's it, huh? Interesting. What is this? Okay. 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 I see. Yeah, it says it looks better the other way, so. <laughs> All right. Avoiding detection. Enemies will see you. All right. Is this silenced? I think I might just need that. Damn, bro. Loot. Okay. I'll go grab this dude shit. can move move bodies too man that <laughs> that fucking sniper kill was crazy guys that is a fucking highlight Go this way. Yeah, it's on the map. I feel like I feel like I don't want to take that road. <laughs> I feel like I want. I feel like I want to flank somehow. But I also feel like there are more enemies over here somewhere. Okay. Okay. I guess I feel safe with that. I don't know though. I'm gonna come around this corner and get fucking murked. Come around this corner and get whacked, yo. Weapon wheel. Okay. Yep, know about weapon.
things. I wanna, I wanna flank around. Well, fuck it, maybe not. Let's go. Let's go up the road. Rather steep. I'm not exactly sure what that does, but I feel smart using it every now and then. See if I might be able to see somebody in there. <laughs> I I just don't know. sniper station interesting damn damn I see lots of dudes down there Explosives. That's cool. Oh, there's two guys right there. Okay. Okay. Types. Okay. Bounties and rivals. Interesting. The enemies thing is cool. Um, Sniper Elite Four uh, uses that. Which, um, actually, speaking of Sniper Elite Four, I I do believe I'll be streaming that uh, tomorrow. Um, but I also want to get, um, I want to try out snipe, uh, sniper elite five as well. So if anybody comes across that and has played it before, just let me know, um, how it is. I definitely want to, uh, definitely want to play that. Okay. All right. So it seems like at this point, um, now that I'm here and kind of have a nest going it's probably a good stopping point um streams right at an hour so i figured that would be good enough to uh chop up and uh give out to you guys so at any rate um thank you guys for uh thank you guys for checking me out thank you for for watching the video um and uh i'll see you guys uh tomorrow yep sniper ghost warrior contracts too later guys